Masha Popek, please tell us about your film, Grown in Detroit. Uh, Grown in Detroit is a documentary, cinema verite documentary about Catherine Ferguson Academy, a uh, Detroit public high school. And it's about, uh, it's a high school with um, teen moms and parenting teens. And um, what's really special about it is that they have their own farm at the school. So they include the, uh, urban, uh, uh, the urban farming into their uh, lessons in school. Now, so the film's based on the urban farming? It's based on the urban farming, but it's it's basically a slice of life in Detroit. So, because you cannot say it's just urban farming, it's it's hopefully, you know, it gets different multi-layered uh, themes within the film. Uh, hopefully the audience will get that from it. Now, urban farming seems to be picking up around the area. Do you see this as a growing phenomenon? I think so. And it's not just the area. I think it's the world. I mean, people are starting to realize that, you know, where is food coming from? I'm coming from the Netherlands. I'm coming from a highly uh, densely populated area. And I realize that my kids don't know where, you know, the carrots or the food are coming from. So it's not just a Detroit. It's all over the place. But I think Detroit has the opportunity to do it. How cool would it be, you know, to be a a farmer on tarmac, you know, and still have the really nice things that the city brings, like going to a ball game or going to the opera. It's all possible down here. Now, the girls that participated in the Catherine Ferguson Academy's urban farming program, how are they doing now? Uh, you know, it's not for everybody. Uh, me, myself, I'm, I'm a filmmaker. I'm not an urban farmer. So uh, not all the, the, the girls will, you know, pr uh, pursue a, a career as being a farmer. But we have girls being a chef. We have girls, you know, uh, doing their own gardens and going to Eastern Market, uh, selling their, uh, their uh, produce at the uh, at Grown in Detroit uh, stand, things like that. So it's really good to see that they're picking it up and they're literally going back to the roots. So that's that's really nice, yeah. What's next for you? What's next for me? Ooh, uh, well, I'm here in uh, in Detroit with my family for you know for this summer for two months, and we're hoping you know to uh, to come down and move to Detroit because we just love it here. What a city, you know. So we'll just see and we'll keep on making films, and we would love to make a film on uh, more films on Detroit because the eyes are on Detroit. You know, this city is the city of the future. What piece of advice would you have for a filmmaker considering a career in the Michigan film industry? Just do it. Just do it. And I'm really, I'm, uh, I, I cannot stress enough to go online and do your film, make your film, go online and be your own distribut uh, distributor. Because, I mean, the internet is befreeing us as filmmakers, as independent filmmakers. And uh, work together and do, do, do your thing. <laughs>